put it at the game. I mean, it would it, it would have been fun because, like I said, previous years, I think I'm one of, one of like one or two people that ever went to Georgia from Reigns. But um, also from Florida, he had almost their whole the whole city from Jacksonville, from Trinity Christian. They had like three, four players on their team that played for Florida. So I always used to, oh man, that's that's good. They get to come back home this time of third. I thought about that at times, but never knew that was going to be in a, in a position I'm in now. Did you ever go to the game as a kid? Um, not really. Like I, like I said, my mom since the day I can remember tailgating a real big party in front of the neighborhood. You know, you attended the game until you played in the game? Or uh, I went over food sometimes that was Florida and everything, but other than that, no. So I'm, what about the, their uh, guys that could big playmakers on the defensive line? They've had a couple guys coming off injuries. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, who stands out for you? What are some of the tough matchups for you guys? Um, Tanaja, he's a he's a very he's like I say he's very fast. He can move around. He really play in uh the uh, the Louisville transfer. I think he's he's really good. He got lots of speed. They're, they're strong guys. They might be they might be undersized to other players in the SEC, but the thing is that they got different. They're strong and they're fast. So they might not have as much size as anybody else, but they're very fast. What's it like playing next to Andrew Thomas and having a guy that sort of rock solid next to you at that left tackle spot? I mean, it, it feels very good to have somebody on my side that's solid and know what they're going to do, they're going to do, they gonna do every play. And sometimes it'd be like, okay, Drew, we'll make a big play. And I, you know me, I have so much excitement, so much joy. And Drew would be like, okay, we made a big play. That's just his personality. He's just so chill, so laid back. And I, like, I remember one time, I think, we scored on a big run. I tried to high five him, jumping up and down with him. He gave me a little <laughs> nudge and just went on to the field goal. I'm like, okay, I understand, Drew. I'm just leave you alone. I'm just give you a slap on him. I'm gonna just go celebrate with somebody else. <laughs> when does he get excited? <laughs> huh? When does he get excited? I mean, Drew get excited every now and then. I remember one play. Um, well, it was one game. I just nobody ever seen. When we was looking at film, Coach Pittman ran the film back. It was like. Who's was number seven one doing all this? He was like, I think he was pumping his arm, doing like this, something like that. We like never seen it. So, in the SEC, every week we got tough pass rushers yeah. to block. Kirby said Gators pass rush the ultimate test, as good as anyone in the country. I mean, when you look at the tape, do they seem that good? Oh yeah, they're they're, they're good as as everybody said they're, they're they're definitely that. So we know that. So we know what we got to work on. We know what they're gonna try to beat us at, and we know what they're coming in to try to do to us pressures on you guys every week. But do you feel like if you can kind of neutralize them or contain them, that's really the key to unlocking this game? Oh, yes, no doubt, no doubt, no doubt. You win the games on the front the front line from all the line defense line. You control those two things, you not to take the win. So I know you guys uh, have a lot to do with keeping Jake uh, you know, on the field for so many games in a row and that kind of thing, but how much savvy do you think he has to to know, you know, when to get rid of the ball to avoid, uh, you know, getting getting clobbered or back there. Like, you know, obviously there's a lot of injuries in, in SEC and across the nation for quarterbacks. I mean, I really don't really don't know about that, but I know Jake. He's gonna make the best decision that he thinks is the It's a good decision. Jake is a very good quarterback. I mean, he attacked the day like he's supposed to. So, Jake, whatever, whatever come at Jake, I know Jake will handle the obstacle. So that's pretty much on Jake. And every decision he makes is gonna be on Jake, and I know it's gonna be a good one. You got.